Oh, hey there, Boda. Happy Friday, dear. Hey, Alma. Happy Friday to you, too. You know, Boda, on Friday nights, I sometimes visit a club so exclusive, nobody else knows it exists. Oh, really? Yeah, it looks bizarrely like my living room and definitely needs a new cleaning staff. <laughs> well, I guess I should have seen that one coming. So what do we have today, dipshit? <laughs> and there it is. Never fail with the verbal abuse, eh? Well, that is kind of my job. Anyways, today we have two clips that you did the other day. Now, the first one, you thought that he was your ex-lover, and then the second... Oh, yes, 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 I remember. Rohim. And I called that girl right after that. Yes, exactly. Let's get into it. She didn't like me at all. Thank you for calling Social Security Administration. How can I assist you today? Uh, uh, yes, you, you said it's the Social Security Administration? Yes, ma'am. Oh, goodness, what? But well, now I'm thoroughly confused. <laughs> oh, goodness, may maybe I can give you my name and you can figure out what's going on for me. All right, just a few minutes. Okay, can you verify me your first and your last name? Uh, yes, my first name is Thelma. Mm -hmm. T H E L M A. T H D H E L M A. Yes. And your last name? Uh, Luis. L O U I S E. Um, Ma'am, do you have any middle initial name? Uh, yes, it's uh, Nancy. N. Yes. It's uh, like N. And ma'am, can you verify me your mailing zip code, please? Uh, that's 24701. 24701? Yes. Okay, ma'am, just give me a quick moment. Let me go ahead and pull out your file and give you more information about this call, okay? All right, thank you, dear. Yeah, you're welcome. Just hold the line for a quick moment. All right, ma'am, thank you for holding the line and thank you for your patience. Yes, Are we no still problem. connected? Yes. Okay, uh, see ma'am, before I go ahead and explain to you each and everything, and before I go ahead and give you more information about this call, in order for me to make sure that I'm going to keep all the confidential information to the right person, uh, can you verify me the last four digits of your social security? Uh, yes, it's 1015. 1015, okay. Yes. Alright, see ma'am. This call is concerning about your social security number. And is your name Rohim? Call... I'm sorry? Is your name Rohim? Your, your voice sounds very familiar. I could swear that we were fuck friends at one point. Is your name Rohim? No. Oh. All right, okay. Your social security number has been found suspicious for fraudulent activity. And there is a case registered under your name, and there is under one my name. going to be issued under your name for drug trafficking, money laundering. Well, God damn it! What the? What the? What? That 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 I didn't do any of that, that. I don't understand. What? What are you talking about, dear? So there is a case registered under your name for drug trafficking, money laundering credit card and debit card fraud. Wait a minute, so wait, a minute wait a are minute, wait a minute. Sir? Are you the person who... Yeah, this is actually Rohim, isn't it? We used to be fuck friends a long time ago. No. Are you my playing a trick Officer on me? Dan my name is Officer Daniel Salmon, and I work for the Social Security Daniel Administration. Son? Daniel Salmon. Daniel Summon? Thomas. T H O M A S. Thomas. Oh, okay. So we we never we never had coitus before. I'm sorry. We've never had coitus before. We've never made the uh, uh you know, no. the, the dirty love. No. Okay. I'm sorry. I I'm, I I was mistaken you for somebody else, dear. I'm sorry. No, my. Uh, I'm sure. I'm sure that we had uh, had uh, bumped nasties at one point. I'm sorry. I didn't catch you. 
I, I thought that we had a one point of time in our lives together made the beast with two backs. No, 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 it's not, it's not me, man. No, okay. My name is Officer Daniel I thought, That's why I thought you I were Rohim. He was a, oh, he was a, a steamy lover. No. All right, sorry, Dan. Sorry. I walk, a I, case of mis I, mistaken I walk, identity, I think it is. Okay, I work for the Social Security Administration, okay, man? Well, he worked for the government as well, so I, I'm not sure where he ended up. Okay, so ma'am, uh, are you aware of all the suspension of your social security number? And well, yes, I am aware of it. You're, you're in the middle of telling me about it, dear. So yes, I am uh, slightly aware. I'm, I'm partially aware, if you will. Okay, and um, there is a case registered on your name for trust. I am becoming aware, lottery. more aware. At every every moment. Okay. So, do you receive any call or do you receive any notification from your local police department? Well, yes, I did. I did call? receive one call, and while well, it was from from you. Okay. No, I mean, what I'm telling you is, uh, do you receive any call from your local police department? Well, they they had called around uh, last week asking for donations for uh, for something that uh, is coming up uh, in this this town, but it had nothing to do with uh, nothing to me personally. No, if that's what you're asking. Okay. So before I go ahead and explain to you and everything, I want you to grab a pen and a paper, okay? Uh, yes, I already have one where where I. Right next to my phone okay. because uh, I'm I'm old fashioned like that. I keep a pen and a paper and a phone book right next to the phone. You see. Okay. First of all, you can write down my information. My name is Officer Daniel Thomas. My first name is Daniel. D A N I. Daniel Summons. Thomas. T H O M A S. Thomas. T O M A F. Yeah. T H O M A S. F at the end? T.S. and Tycho, T.S. and Tycho, H.S. and Henry, O like a Mosca, M like a Mary, okay. A like so, an Apple, okay. S like a... Sir. Thomas. Thomas, yes, okay. So David Thomas. I'm sorry? David Thomas. Okay, yeah. And uh, you can write on my federal employee number. Yes. My federal page ID number starts with letter F like a Frank, A like an Apple, F A. We stand for federal agent 79005. All right. And you can write on your case number. Okay. Your case number start with letter B, like a Tom, like a Thomas. Like, S like is in a. song? T, T like a Tom. C, uh. T, T, Tom. Yeah, X like an X-ray. All right. Seven, zero, one, zero. I'll repeat it again. T, X, T -X seven, zero, one, zero. one, zero. Yes. Yeah. Okay, now, first of all, I just want to invite you that the line which we are having conversation right now, it's been federally recorded and monitored by the officers of the Social Security Administration, your local conditioner of department, and as well as from the... Uh, uh, Debra, Debra. Hey, Debra, it's Thelma. <laughs> Debra, hi, Debra. Debra is always the one that does, does those things down at the local, at our, at our police department here. I, I beg your pardon, ma'am? Well, well, you said that my, the local uh, a police department is uh, listening in as well. That would be Deborah, and I know her personally. So, hi, Deborah. Department of Social Security Administration, how can I help you today? Uh, yes, I, I just got uh, disconnected um, uh, with an individual that I was just speaking with here. Okay, so you received a call from our department, ma'am? Uh, yes, well, yes, I did. And I, I have a, uh, a case file number here, and it's uh, TX7010. Okay, so 
you were speaking with one of our officers, right? Uh, yes, yeah. And he got disconnected. Yes, yes, we just we just got disconnected, and he had just given me the the case file number. So I don't even know what's going on yet. What? I don't I don't Can understand. Can you help me with the name of the person, ma'am? Um, I think it was David Simon. Some, I'm David not Simon. sure. I couldn't really make. I was trying to. We were we were trying to. He was trying to get his name out to me, but it was hard to understand what he was saying. Uh, it was okay, either so, David or Daniel or something. Okay, so let me tell you why you got a call from our department. Let me tell you the reason, okay? Okay, wouldn't you, wouldn't you have to, okay, yes. The reason you received the call from us was to inform me about the legal proceeding being initiated against you. Your name and social security number oh, what, has been associated name, with illegal activities and we have received a court order to suspend your social security number right yeah, at this moment. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. are you aware about this, ma'am? Yes, yes. Uh, I, well, yes, I, I was becoming aware um, at the time of the call being disconnected. I was, uh, it was, it was just mentioning, he was starting to mention, but uh, he didn't actually mention it so um i'm unsure of what actually is going on he wasn't he didn't actually get into that part yet okay so first of all can you please help me out with your first and last name ma'am oh yes it's it's thelma was my first name t-h-e-l-m-a it's t-e-t-l-m-e no T right? no t-h-e-l-m-a Okay. And I do believe you have a last name, right? Well, yes, dear. I believe everybody does okay. at, at one point of time in their lives. Okay. Uh, my last name is Louise. <laughs> it's L O U I S E. Okay, Louise, right? Louise. Okay, thank you. And middle Keep initial Louise. is N for Nancy. So it's Thelma and okay, Louise. So can you please help me out with your current zip code? Uh, yeah, sure, dear. It's 24701 currently. 24701. Okay, thank you. Yes, un until ma I rob some you... banks and have to move. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay. So, ma'am, can you please help me out with the last four digits of your social security number? Uh, yes, so it's that... 1015. Okay. It's... 1015, right? Uh, yeah, dear, that's correct. Okay, thank you, ma'am. And can you please grab a piece of paper and a bank? Uh, I already I have one, yes. I, I already I already had okay, one so with my, David there. All right, all right. So you are speaking with Officer Sophia Garcia. So, Sophia? Garcia, Sophia Garcia. S O F I N, Sophia. G A R C I S G as in George, A as in Alpha, R as in Romeo, C as in Charlie, I as in Alan, okay. A as in Alpha. Yes, yes, I, Sophia uh, Garcia. Yes, I, it's a very common name. Yes, yes. Okay, and write down my badge IT number. It will be S S A S as in Scotland, S as in Scotland, A as in Alpha. What did you say? S is what is in what? For, what were the first two? S S A two S A seven nine. Four, no, no, no. Five, I'm one. not. Sure. I can't hear the first letters of what you're saying. It's ma'am. S as in Scotland, and S as in Scotland. S as in. F, F is in Falkland. Okay. F is yes, in. Yes, F is in Falkland. F is in Falkland. A as in Alpha. A as in Alpha. Okay. Seven nine four five one. Okay, so before I give you the further information, I would like to inform you that this is a federally recorded line and a three-week conference call. The Department of Homeland Security, U.S. Marshals, and TAS, so speak or promise must be true yeah. and honest. Since nice. this is an ongoing investigation and the case has not been concluded, we can only provide you with limited information, only the summary, and not the whole detail, all right? Well, when do so, I get the whole details, dear? 
while I'm reading this information, if you have any doubt, you can ask me after I'm done giving you the details. Okay, ma'am? What do you mean if I have any doubt? That's some weird um, uh, wording for a, for an accusation. Is it, is it like, if you believe us or not, let us know at the end? I don't understand. It's a weird way of wording it, dear. Doubt. Okay, please, you shouldn't ma'am. say doubt when, when dealing with uh, these kind of things. Listen to me, Because now I'm, I'm a little bit doubtful. This, this case is all about money laundering and drug trafficking. So before we move any further, we'd like to know if you have ever been to the state of Texas before. I doubt it. So you've been to the state of Texas or you've never been? I, I doubt it. So, have you ever rented a car before, ma'am? Uh, um, I, I doubt it. You didn't, or you did? Well, I mean, I doubt that I did. You rented a car before? I doubt it. Mom, I didn't get you. You didn't doubt it, or you didn't get it? Didn't get what, dear? You're confusing me. Have you ever rented a car before, ma'am? I Have doubt. I doubt that there's uh, any factual uh, evidence that I uh, that I actually did. The reason why I'm asking you is because we found an abandoned car on the south border of Texas. And the car was Toyota Corolla, and the vehicle registration number is DX1440, and it contains some blood and drug inside the car. Uh, undoubtedly. So undoubtedly, but but the, that does not take away from the fact that there Can is no doubt it was not me. It's your date of birth, ma'am? My date of birth is April 1st, 1959. It's 1959, right? Yes, 1959. Okay, thank you. Okay, ma'am, so let me connect your call to Mr. You, I I believe you spoke with Mr. David, right? Um, David, I, I believe, maybe. Sorry, ma'am? David Simon? David Simon, okay. Let me connect your call to Mr. David Simon, okay? Uh, all right, yeah. She doesn't want to deal with me. Well, there it is, folks. Me and Elma are going to go work on some material for tonight. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you did, hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe if you haven't already. And when it comes to sharing, well, it's important, folks. More important than your second kidney, actually. Statistically, anyways. Well, maybe I misunderstood the numbers. I don't know. All I know is that it's good. So do it. And until the next one, Boda out. Boda. Oh my God. Boda. Boda. We don't know who is the culprit. Boda. Once I remove the virus, your computer will run faster. You have been invaded.